Good morning, Moreland. Happy Friday, October 7th, 2022. It is a day four on the day cycle calendar. Happy Friday, everybody. It feels good to say that, doesn't it? Um, and the even better is this is the start of a three-day weekend for you. So happy Friday and the start of a three-day weekend. That's right. You heard me correctly. There is no school on Monday. So uh, after today, I will see you on Tuesday unless I see you tomorrow at the Rainbow Run. Don't forget, ladies and gentlemen, that tomorrow is the Rainbow Run. Um, it starts at nine o'clock in the morning. So come on out, bring your family, your friends, your neighbors, your cousins, your aunts, your uncles, your grandparents, come on out and join us tomorrow. Um, you can register online tonight. Uh, you can come tomorrow and register at the table. Um, come join us, come walk, come run, come um, just enjoy the morning together. It's supposed to be a gorgeous day um, and, and, and uh, celebrate our school. So uh, hope, hopefully I see you tomorrow. If I don't see you tomorrow, I will see you then again on Tuesday. Nonetheless, happy, happy Friday. On this October 7th, Chance Ware in fifth grade is celebrating birthday. If you see Chance around the school, be sure to wish him a happy, happy birthday. And tomorrow on our Rainbow Run, we'd like to wish Nicole Iannuzzi a happy birthday. She is also in fifth grade. So happy birthday to you, Miss Nicole, tomorrow. Today's breakfast is a cinnamon toast uh, cereal bar. Uh, Monday's or Tuesday's breakfast is a Cine Mini. Today's lunch is the pizza and the alternate is the muffin cheese and yogurt fun lunch. Resolve. It's our last day to use this word uh, for our challenge this week. Did you have the resolve to find a way to use the word resolve in a sentence? Remember, resolve means tenacity, perseverance, persistence. It's kind of like a synonym for our, our core essential grit. I challenge you to find an opportunity or a chance to incorporate this word resolve into your conversation today. And writing counts as well. So it is Friday, so try to get that word into your conversation this week. I think some of you probably have the resolve to get to school this morning by just waking up and putting on your clothes and coming to school because... Friday, ladies and gentlemen, it is sometimes very hard to get to school. So here's to an awesome, awesome Friday. Find an, an opportunity to use that word this week or today. There are going to be times this school year when you want to give up. The essay is too long. The math problem is too hard. The science equation too complex. The history lesson too confusing. But that's when you have to have some grit. Refuse to give up. Refuse to give in. Ask for help. Don't do it alone. No one said you have to. You had to do it all on your own. Asking for a little help when you need it, it to help you get the task done doesn't mean you don't have grit. In fact, sometimes asking for help means you have grit because you realize you want to keep persevering. You want to get it done. You just need a little assistance. So good advice this, on this Friday. Um, when, you, when you are so close to finishing something and you, you want to do it, um, you realize you just need a little extra help or a little extra assistance, it's okay to ask for help to to persevere and, and and build that grit muscle um so be willing to do that monitor yourself monitor your understanding monitor your body your feelings your emotions and if you need the help ask for help we will continue some of you might need some grit tomorrow when you're on the rainbow run you'll be practicing uh running that uh, or walking that 5k um, but we'll continue to talk about grit this this uh this month of october i I, I, I've already seen so many great examples of grit around the school and I'm hearing great examples of grit and people using um, grit in their, uh, and the vocabulary word in their sentences and explanations. So keep up the awesome work. Um, the month has just begun. That is it for today. I hope you have an awesome Friday. I hope you work hard, show kindness to love and love to one another. And I just hope you're awesome friends and classmates to each other on this Friday. Enjoy this gorgeous Friday and this amazing weekend we're about to start. See you all on Tuesday. Let's stand and say our Moreland mantra together. I am kind. I am capable. I am valued. We are one. Remain standing for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Have a great day, Moreland. Have a good luck tomorrow at the Rainbow Run, and have a wonderful weekend. See you all on Tuesday.